Nope. All right. So we've got construction still underway in here. The snake tank is almost done. We still just got to put in some heating and some ventilation. There's the old tank up there. Over here, we're gonna have a tortoise pin. That giant sheet is laying. Up there, let's see if we can zoom in. Rosie the boa constrictor. She'll be moving out of there. She's hardly ever in there anyway. She usually gets the run of the room in here. Gets plenty of room to come out and do whatever she wants. She goes back in there to eat and digest though. Eat and digest and her water dish is in there. But this is the new retic enclosure. She's out right now. I should have zoomed out. I can't even see what I'm filming. Let's hope that turns out. Where'd you go, bud? Get a close up. Stretch. Stretch out for the camera. How far can you go? How far can you go? Uh, uh. Oh, too far. <laughs> you ready to go into your new home, bud? I'm ready for you to go into your new home. You might have a roommate for a little bit. You might have a roommate for a little bit. Whoop, whoop. You're stuck. You're stuck. You're not sliding across my arm too easy. There you go. Let's go get a better look at Rosie. Rosita. Which is actually a male. It's named Rosie. Because when I bought her, I thought she was a female, or he was a female. But he's about 20 years old now. About 20 years old. An old timer. An old one. Yep. This will probably be my Emperor Scorpion enclosure. The snakes will move into here. To this big bad boy. Let's see here. And then over here. We might get a bearded dragon, possibly. Possibly, possibly, possibly. And of course the tortoise pin. I'm not sure if tortoises and bearded dragons can coexist, but if they can, the bearded dragon might might be roommates with the tortoise. We'll see. We will see. Because that would be pretty cool for him to have all that room to run around in also. It's an 8 by... What, it was 41 inches. I had to cut it down to 41 inches to fit in the back of the truck. So... Pretty good space. My yellow foot's going in there. 
Let's see if we can get a peek in at him. He's sleeping. I don't know if we can see in there. Nah, no, you can't see in there too well. It's nighttime. We're disturbing him. Yep, yeah, that's the plans for the reptile room. Retick and boa enclosure. Future. Emperor scorpion enclosure. Possible bearded dragon enclosure. We got all kinds of junk all around because we're under construction in here. We'll clean all this up, get it looking nice. And tortoise pen slash potential bearded dragon enclosure. It's gonna be pretty cool. Artwork from high school. <laughs> All right, I don't know why we filmed that, but we did. <laughs> so that's about it. I don't know how looking at a slab of melamine on the floor is exciting content, but it's the uh, it's the vision. It's the vision in progress, huh, buddy? Yeah, I should have been filming you more, huh? You're the star of the show. You're the star of the show. Yes, that's what we want to see. Your beautiful patterns. Alright. That's it. I just wanted to get this documented for future reference. For when it's all done, I can look back and think, wow, look how far we've come. Look at how far we've come. Pretty cool. Alright, that's it now. Peace.